Sean in Ottawa, Ontario, right? Paul, as an older audiophile, hey, welcome to the club. <laughs> My primary source material is analog, mostly vinyl, uh, but I also have a large collection of tapes from over the years. I know that from both my own ears and technically that cassettes are inferior to LPs, but I can still get some pretty darn good sounds out of my higher end Akai tape deck. And the recordings uh, are of good quality, especially if they are type two or type three. So what's your opinion of this media? Am I nuts for still liking them? Also, do you think PS Audio will ever produce a tape deck? <laughs> well, I can tell you that my son, Scott, he always wanted to do a cassette deck. And, uh, you know, I encouraged him to, to try, you know, see what you could do. I don't think there's much of a market for it, but it is kind of nostalgic. It's kind of cool. I think cassette decks were a lot cooler than reel-to-reels. I had a, of course, all of us had at one point a cassette deck. I had a Nakamichi. And it was great. I remember when, uh, what was it? Was it Dolby? I think it was Dolby. Uh, something we did that just extended the high frequency response of those cassettes. That was great. Cassettes are basically a little quarter inch tape, for those of you that don't know what a cassette is. But it's, it's a contained reel to reel. So the, the, the take up reel and the supply reel are all contained inside of a little plastic case. Call a cassette, you pop it in and go and mixtapes were a big deal. You would, for your loved one or for your friend, you would put together a mixtape of the songs that you liked the best. And then you could hand that cassette to somebody and go, here. And then you had your s favorite tracks on there, which was kind of cool. And I think for those purposes, all of that was, was, was cool. I, personally, I, I am not nostalgic at all over that stuff. I, I don't know, maybe I'm just, you know, an insensitive galoot, and that's probably true. <laughs> I've never been accused of being overly sensitive about anything. So, nah, doesn't do much for me, and I, I, I don't, I think Scott lost the fire to, to do that, and I, I, I just, I think they're cool as a, a nostalgic piece, but I don't think it's anything we would ever get involved with, but I do understand the love of those things. I mean, they're kind of cool. They're kind of cool. So, all right. Thanks for the question. <laughs> Talk to you later, and good luck. <laughs> Bye.